business and law programme gives students an opportunity to explore different careers in both business and law. It gives you flexibility. It's a very balanced degree. In first, second and third year, you study both business and law equally. So that means six business modules and six law modules every year. And then as you progress throughout the course, you get more choice. So in third year, you get to choose all your law modules. So if you know by third year you want to go down the law route, you can pick law modules that you need for your FE1s. And then in fourth year, you get even more choice. So if you know you want to go down the law route, for example, you can pick eight law modules and four business modules. Whereas if you know you want to go down the business route and accounting, for example, you can pick eight business modules and four law modules. I would recommend the business and law programme to a student who is not certain what career path they want to embark upon, but would like to get a high profile degree to enable them to go into either the profession of law or down a business career path. The first year experience for business and law students is a whole new change from second level education. You'll be thrust into large lecture theatres and also into small group teaching in the form of tutorials. And this takes quite a while for some first year students to adapt to. So if you find yourselves after six weeks only just beginning to settle in, don't be surprised. Being a business and law student requires a lot of skills that other courses might require. That's because of the dual nature of the degree. So for example, for law you want to be comfortable reading cases, you want to be comfortable writing essays, you want to be able to have good speaking skills for example. Whereas the business degree side of things you need to be good at analytics, good at strong enough at maths, you want to be good at teamwork. A lot of projects you do in the business school are team projects and that's kind of the hard bit of being the student but it's also the rewarding bit. The best thing about this course is that there are so many career opportunities available at the end. So for example if you're business orientated you can go down the accountancy route, you know, can go down the finance, insurance route or even the banker route. Whereas if you're more law orientated you can go down the solicitor route, try get a seat in a big five law firm and do your FE1s. The Business and Law programme offers a wide range of institutions at which you can study. These are based in six European countries and we also have links in Australia and America. It is a marvellous opportunity to develop as a person emotionally, educationally, socially and culturally. I'm going down to Brisbane but I had the opportunity to go to Sydney, Milan, Barcelona, Oklahoma, um, Rouen in Fran France and Madrid in Spain. So there's such a variety of places you can go to with the course. I think it'll be great to show employers in the future that I was willing to travel halfway across the world and pursue an opportunity that, that arose for me. The uh, Business and Law programme here in UCD is the longest running programme of its kind uh, on the island. Uh, you have the benefit of the depth of knowledge of the Quinn School of Business and the UCD Sutherland School of Law, both well established reputations in their respective fields. UCD, the main reasons are that the business school is triple accredited, it's very highly ranked and the law schools and the top 100 law schools in the world. It means that by the end of your degree, you have a degree from a fantastic college that will look great on your CV and hopefully provide you good opportunities in the future. Mm -hmm.